Well, greetings and salutations, everybody. Welcome back once again, and for the very first time, to the Farts and Crap Show, where today, it's uh, just Danjo here, and um, Seth doesn't know about this yet, at the time of recording, but um, I thought I should go back through some of the levels we've already done, and grab some of the power-ups. Um, because, uh, yeah, Seth is not familiar with the final episode, but I am. Uh, and I've gone through here before. Isn't there supposed to be music that plays right here? So if there's an X on it, that means we've gone through there, so we haven't actually done this level. Um, there's just no character on that one. And what if I hit back? can go back to the campfire, right? That's something you can do. Uh, let's see, I'm using a slightly different controller today. Isn't there a run button? Oh, you know what? Because I usually play with a Sega Genesis controller. And I believe I have my run button to be C. Yep, which on that controller is ZR. So. That's not bad. I could change it, I guess. To be like A instead and have X be my sub-weapon button, but why would I do that? So it feels more like Castlevania, <laughs> I guess. Yeah, it's fine. Yeah, the music is supposed to play here. Yeah, there it is. Weird. Um, yeah, level one we didn't get one, which I think I know where it is, and I'm Fairly certain that, uh, it's the Hachi way, which is, ah, it's a scythe, okay, which is down here. Can't remember the best way to take these guys out. I mean, we have Robert, so might as well do it that way. Miriam is also pretty good at that. Wait, there's a crack here. Can I break that? No? Oh, right, we did get the attack upgrade. Right, so I can't take these guys out in one shot now. And that guy's pointing that way. Oh, to go through the thing instead of going down. Um, I believe that's just a shortcut, though. I can't remember. Hmm. I guess we'll find out. Um, let's see. Rather use Ngetsu for this. Yeah, that's where the, um, if I flew through as a uh, Jeebel, who we don't have yet, 
or tried to do that trick with uh, Robert where he crawled through a hole in the wall. I believe... Damn it, I don't want that. Um, hmm. Oh yeah, Hachi can take those things out. Skills. I could also do it this way. There we go. Uh oh. I think it's up there. How am I gonna do that though? Oh, brick. Pretty sure it's up there. Hmm. Let's see if I can get a trick jump thing going. No. 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 Ah, almost. I have to use that ledge to do this, so. I think I also could have used Hachi for that. Doesn't look like... well, maybe. Yeah. Oh yeah, I forgot. Miriam has the dash thing. I don't want that. Yep, there it is. Weapon points, alright. Yeah, I don't think there's anything left in this level. Since we've already beat this level, I'm pretty sure I can just exit. Try that again. Let's see, what are we at? Forty five? Acquired items will be saved, yeah. I see. Yeah. Takes you straight to the stage select where you don't um, have the music. Right. So it's not as much of a glitch as like a oversight, I guess. If you want to put it that way. Alright, we're eight minutes in. So yeah, since we've already taken out the bosses. Um, for this stage, I think for one of them that we don't have, I'm um, I want to say you need, uh, oops, uh, Jeeble, but I might be wrong, it might be one of those glitch jump things you can do. Damn it, could have got that. I know one of them, yeah, is Hachi, so... At least I 
think there's a power up this way. Wait, those guys are in the first game. Yeah. Yeah, they are. As are the little fairy things that fly around. Um... Nope. Alright. I keep looking for the axe, because, like, everything else I don't really care. Oh, shit. Oh, wait. That's right, he can just, uh... He can duck underneath. Yeah. As long as you get that ability to crouch. Yeah, screw it, I'll just take the weapon points. Sorry guys, this one's gonna be light on commentary because I'm trying to focus. Because the timing, that's part of the reason I love this game. The timings are like, super exact. Like when I'm using like a like a Switch style controller, like Super Nintendo style controller specifically, um, where you have the standard ABXY layout, like A is typically dash, like X is typically sub weapon, and then B and Y are jump and uh... crap. I need something specific here, don't I? jump and attack, respectively. Um, I guess fire shield would be best? Ah, oh, crap. Let's see, once again, I pressed the wrong button. I think... Oh. Right. I need Dominique's weapon. Or Jeeble. But I don't have Jeeble, so we need the super jump. It sucks. And that would be right here, but I already screwed my chances. <sighs> Frick. Alright, whatever. Point is, I don't know where the other upgrade is. It could also be this way? I don't know. I think it is, but it might be. I really don't like having the, uh... The double tap direction be dash. Because sometimes I accidentally dash like that. There we go. Oh, right. Seth has the different button layout. That's right. Oh, whoops. Um, can you not turn it off in this game? Just change it to how I prefer it for now. So Y being attack, B being jump, dash being A, sub weapon being X. Confirm and return. Oh, because I hit plus. Or in this case, start. Okay, gotcha. Huh. In the original, you could turn those things on or off if you wanted to. So you could do, like, to have it feel more like Castlevania, 
Um, you could have like up an attack be your sub weapon, um, and you could choose to have um, you could choose to have a. Uh, I get this. I feel like I don't want to risk it right now. Uh, you can choose to turn the dash command of uh, double tapping a direction on or off. Which, uh, I typically prefer a dedicated button for that kind of thing. Sucks not having Zangetsu, but... Oh, this is where What's-His-Butt shows up. I remember this. Oh! Did get one. Guys, really, uh, rock your shiz. Don't want to dash again. There we go. Okay. Um. Pretty sure I missed the other upgrade. Don't think it's this way. Pretty sure it was that up direction earlier. Oh. That was poorly timed. Oh yeah, Robert can take these guys out. Super easy. Forgot about that. not watching for falling debris. That was uh, a bad idea. Also going for that is equally a bad idea. Hmm. And just like that I have the worst characters for this. Well, Hachi's not the worst. There is a good Hachi strategy here. One. Do your spit thing, thank you. This does feel weird. Like, pretty much always play this with a Sega Genesis controller. <laughs> Which, yeah, that does make me kind of weird. But, you know what? Oh, this might... No, this isn't it. This is not it. I missed it. Oh yeah, I could have just done it this way. The old man combo. Actually, Robert's just really good at that. I mean, he's short, but, you know. Aside from his stature... Can't just walk through that shit. Oh, yeah. They have to be... From where the axes spawn, they have to be, like, outside of the thing, whatever. You know what? I'm just gonna exit. I already have the upgrade. Um... It'll save that, you know, 
I have it. And then we have one player. Yeah. So I got the health upgrade, but there's one more. I think it might be a weapon point upgrade. But maybe not. Yeah, Miriam's the way to go here. And I don't really care about points right now, so I'm not gonna go back for those other lamps. Um, but yeah, pretty positive I screwed it up last time. the jump. Yeah, that's the jumpies. Okay. I was just gonna say, I don't know where they're gonna give me the jump, so I guess I should just hit all of them with Miriam. Or not Miriam, Dominique. Uh, that's dirty. They give it to you like at the beginning of the area. Well, they probably give you one more chance to get it, but I don't know. How low can... Oh, wow. Like on the first pixel. There's a duck button, you know. But sadly, there's no goose button. Right. Oh my goodness, what the frick? There we go. Just want plenty of weapon points. Alright, now we don't need that, so I can just use it for weapon points. And I'm gonna want a fire shield, switch to Dominique, do the super jump to get up there. Then go. Wait, what? Really? How? Oh, shit. No, 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 no. Come on. Fire freeze? No, I can't do that one. I was gonna say, like, if you can freeze stuff, you can use them as steps. So you need Jeeble. Oh, that sucks. There's no other... No. There's... there's... That's it. You need Jeeble. Right? Like, there's no other... I mean, you could do it in two-player. For sure. I mean, all right, that's fine. We'll come back, uh, Seth, I guess. I'm trying to think if there's another, there is another spot in that level, but I th think it's also for Jeeble. 
Um, So I'm not going to do the levels we haven't gotten, obviously. Like the one where the last one, where you get Jeebel, and this one. Uh, I want to find out for sure. the timing there. Alright, I'm gonna try... Oh. I'm gonna try going this way. Because I can't... Okay. Yeah, this is one of those areas where I'm... Fairly certain you can get through without Jeebel. Like, it's meant for Jeebel, but you can kind of cheese it with a combination of Hachi and Robert, I think. I believe so. So, if you do this and then. Crap. I think you need to do it on two different controllers is my problem. Yeah. I believe so. I don't think there's any other secrets on this stage. There's this one, this way, I can't remember if it's four. And there's that one, which I think we went that way before, so I don't think that's it. Oh, fuck. Oh, Hachi can just walk in this stuff? Oh, that's good to know. Oh, it's the reviving stuff for uh, Dominique. Yeah, I don't care about that right now. Oh, should get that help though. I think this is the way the Seth and I went. Yeah, it was. And I didn't see a... Oh wait, no, we did. We did see a thing this way. Did we go that way, though, or did we miss it? No, it wasn't this one. Right, because I was like, remember the pogo thing? And he's like, no, I don't remember. Shit. Okay, alright. So yeah, we can't get any other secrets on this level. Not without Jeebel. Or, you know, two-player. Uh, okay. Veteran. There, so we have two stages down. Third stage and fourth stage, we didn't get anything. Um. Yeah, I think I know where this one is. But this might be a Jeebel only one. I think you need Jeebel or two players to get that way.
don't know what that was. I think it was just points, but we'll find out. I might be wrong, but I think this is one of the few upgrades where it's just the regular path. Wow. Not work out. Oh yeah, this is Robert's stage. Right. That's why most of the enemies are easily gotten by him. Right, I think actually it is this way. Because there's that one um, infinitely shooting dude down one of these spots. That guy. And the only way to get him... Oh no, you can get him with fire shield. That's right. And the other guys I really don't care about. This is where the upgrade is? Could be wrong. Oh yeah, those ones instantly blow up. Well, I think it depends on how much damage you deal. I think if you haven't gotten an attack upgrade, they inflate the first time and then blow up the second time. I think so. Wait, no, we went that way, didn't we? I want to say we did. But I also don't remember this way. If you go the other way, it's just... It's all over there. Um, so, I'm gonna go this way. This might be it. Are we full right now? Dude. What the hell? Um.
Hmm. Ah, oh, crap, that was the one we got. That's right. Well, that was one of the upgrades. This one is this way? Maybe. Wait, didn't we get the other one? Or did they move it? Is it down from here? too far already. Yeah, because this is the boss area. Yeah, I think it's a secret way. Which, yeah, you either need two-player or you need, um... Wait, didn't we see the other one earlier in this stage? And I was like frustrated because I uh, like skipped it or something. I seem to remember something like that. Okay. Well, folks, here's what I'll do. Um, there's two stages left that I can backtrack to and I need to figure out uh, without doing the two stages that Seth and I haven't done yet as far as like, you know, in this area and stuff. So I'm gonna do one more of these probably. No, we'll just go a little bit long. No, I'll do one more of these, so. Uh, but yeah, and I didn't wanna do it off screen, so. Um, Thank you guys for joining me for this uh, solo fill in the gaps kind of thing. Because um, believe me, this game gets hard at the end. Uh, if you don't get the upgrades, you're in for a rough time. But um, yeah, very special thank you, of course, to the Farts and Crafts Show members, Old Cranky Gamer and Novalis Draconis. Um, as well as all of you guys who stopped by and uh, stuck around for the end. Greatly appreciate it. Hope you had a good time. And uh, until next time, everybody, take care and hope you all have a wonderful day.